Hey guys, how's it going? I hope y'all are doing well today. As you guys know, in the 19.1 patch recently, all your ships got deleted if you had bought any using AUEC. So today we'll be working on getting some money back, getting those ships back, and getting back where we need to be. A quick side note, I'm thinking of making a playlist of different things that you could do to start farming money, and just things you can do in general, so let me know what you guys think of that. On that note, today's topic will be doing service beacons. First what you want to do is make your way over to an ASOP terminal. Once you're here, go ahead and pull out a ship where you're able to do air-to-air -air combat because that's what we're going to be doing today. Preferably, I would have some sort of ship like a Corsair, Constellation, um, any sort of gunship that you're able to do low to medium threats in pretty easily. Um, if you don't have that, that's totally okay. You could always go down to one of the major cities and pick one up at the rental shop. Alright, once you're out of the station, go ahead and press on your Moby Glass, and then go ahead and click on Contracts, and then go down to Service Beacons. You may or may not have any here. This really just depends on what your rating is. My rating is 5 because I've grinded out a few and I have completed them successfully. Another small note, there might not even be a service beacon tab because people might be taking up the low and high tier and even medium threats. Also, it's really important to stay in a more densely populated area to be able to get more uh, combat threats. However, if you're always in a really populated area, that also means there's a good chance someone is going to take up a service beacon before you're able to take it up. Also, in the Constellation Andromeda, you can do a decent amount of high threats solo, but it's, I, in my opinion, it's really not worth the time. What I suggest doing is sticking to low and medium threats that pay anywhere between 9 to 30,000 within the same system. We just picked up a low threat and you can always check that in the accepted and just make sure to track it and uh, let's go ahead and go there. You'll see a service beacon pop up like this. Sometimes your quantum beacon won't pop up and you might have to go into your Moby glass and your map and then set a point to it. Alright, this is just a low threat so once you're here go ahead and wait for a quick second you'll see stuff spawn and then wait for your targets to turn red and then start attacking. Alright, once you're complete with the contract, it'll say contract complete and something really important that I do is always give them a good rating. I feel like that always gives you much more um, rep and one of the nice things about this is you get your rep pretty fast and uh, you can get going really quickly as well. Alright, I just went back to Microtech where we will be getting more missions, but I'm still having trouble getting missions and even picking them up if they show up. Um, something you might want to do is bedlog and go ahead and just switch over to a different server, and usually that helps a lot. Alright, so you just want to keep doing those over and over again. You can head to different systems, you could switch servers if you're not getting any. I hope you guys like this method for making some quick money. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. That helps me out a lot. And I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.